everybody, it's Robin. Um, hadn't been on a while, so I thought that I would do a quick little video. I'm not sure when this will be uploaded, but because um, I'm having some issues with the computer that I normally upload on. But anyway, I thought that I would share um, some things with you that I was sitting here doing this morning. Um, and uh, just say hi to everybody. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and get started. I had bought um, some of these little card kits when they were on clearance at Michael's, and I think I only gave a couple of dollars for them. Um, so I've, I was making those up, and here's here's what they look like. Um, I hope that I have a good view. Let's see, let me put this over here. I um, hope this is a good view of them. But they turned out so sweet, just little just little quick cards um, nothing real fancy I don't even have my thing on the back but uh, I thought they were so cute so I made that one and I did add a, a few things to this one and did this one a little bit differently than what they had in um, the picture here um, you can see that they did. They just had stamped this directly on the card, and I didn't really want to do that. It needed a little bit more something, so I popped it up and put it on a little banner, and then I added some um, beige and white baker's twine too, because there wasn't near enough of this jute that was within the kit to, you know, to really fill it out. So that was really the only thing different that I had done on those on that set. And then on um, this set, here these are, um, same thing, they were on clearance and all. Um, I didn't do anything differently. I made it exactly the way that, um, that the example showed. But what I was thinking was, those would be so nice to put together and then make a little box for them. Um, and sell them or give them as a you know a little gift but I was more or less thinking about selling them once I do. I am going to open an Etsy shop at some point. I'm just trying to build up a inventory and I haven't crafted since before Christmas so I have some work to do. So I was thinking that since I was going to do that that I could just kind of take a cue from those two kits and come up with my own little note cards that I could bundle together, and this is one of them that I came up with. Um, I used this little Spellbinders die that I picked up at Tuesday morning on them, and then I made um, some little banners and used um, a hello from a, I don't even know what kit. Let me see here. Oh, right here. I picked this up at Tuesday morning too a while back and it had the dies and the little um, stamps that went with it so I used the hello from this and it's a Hero Arts stamp and die kit. So I did that and then I put um, to pop them up. Um, I don't know if you all are doing this or not but you know the um, the normal dots to make things three-dimensional they're quite expensive even if you find them on sale or something plus I find if you go to mail them um, to mail your cards and stuff if you're using those just the little dots and everything that they'll divot and crumble your card so I love using these foam sheets um, that you can pick up at Walmart. You can pick them up pretty much anywhere for just pennies on the dollar. You can buy them, and uh, then you can cover your whole, your entire area um, cheaply. Plus, it's more more sturdy. So, anyway, um, those are some that I was making, and I thought that I would just put these three together and uh, talk to you while uh, while I was putting them together. Um, here's the uh, the little cutouts that I did and if you'll notice on the back or you can uh, see the keys down here on the back I had added um, some silver cardstock and then I added a little bling and then just 
tucked a little piece of cream cardstock in there and um, ink the edges with vintage photo. So I'm just going to sit here and oh, hang on just one second. I need to get a glue stick. Bear with me. Sorry. I apologize. I'm coming back. Coming back. Okay. I'm back wasn't very well prepared. I just turned the camera on and thought that I would talk to you and while I was sitting here crafting this morning. So, uh, I want to thank all of my new subscribers um, and, and I apologize to, uh, to you because I haven't had any new content or anything out um, in such a long time. But uh, I want to welcome you, and I had thought that maybe I would uh, sit down and just do shout outs to every all of my new subscribers, but I just, that would that would take me. I would have to do two or three videos. <laughs> um, so what I want to do is just to each and every one of you, I saw where you subscribed, and I want to thank you and uh Hopefully, I'll be able to uh, get some new content out and some new, maybe some tutorials and, um, or maybe I can just do things like that, do videos like this to where I sit and craft and chat with you and maybe it'll, maybe you'll get some inspiration or something from, uh, from cards or mini albums or whatever it is that I'm trying, you know, that I'm sitting and doing. And, uh just sit and chat. Um, was thinking about, and I've been thinking about this for a while, um, doing some videos of, uh, and calling it fakeable makeables, where I go on Pinterest and see something that I really like, but, um, and maybe I just don't have that exact thing, so I would fake it and do something else, sort of like, um, Sort of like I did, you know, I took inspiration from these kits and doing, um, doing my own thing. Um, so I was thinking about maybe doing some videos like that. Um, I know that I had promised a tutorial a while back on uh, a mini album. I hadn't forgotten about it, but um, I just haven't been in my craft room, you know. just haven't crafted since before Christmas. And... Um, had a lot of things going on, nothing bad or anything like that. I just, you know, just life and this, that, and the other. And I'm sure all of you all can understand that. Um, what else? What else? What else? Oh, Beth from Beth's Scrapbook Room found out that, uh, I don't know if you all know her or not. I know a lot of my old subscribers do, but um, I just want to say that I'm, if, if you're watching Beth, I'm praying for you. Um, I saw where your house had caught on fire, and uh, I'm just, I'm praying for you, and I'm, I'm so sorry, and I hope that um, by now that you're starting to get all that taken care of and, and back in your home, and I just hate that so bad. That just breaks my heart, and if there, there's anything I can do, just let me know. Um, what else? Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I miss you all. I miss you all bad. Um, I don't really sit and have, have much time to, uh, watch videos anymore, so I don't really know anything else that's going on. I'm just so out of the loop. But I miss you all really bad. So, anyway, get this one on here and there you go. See how quickly that goes? So I was thinking that would be uh, really, really cute to, whoops, to uh, put these together. Let me move this out of the way. To uh, put these together and make like a little, you know, a little box for them. 
where the packaging would look cute and just have eight little note cards and I'll have to pick me up some envelopes but uh, that's them and see how quickly that went of course I put all the other stuff together but just something real quick fun and easy and uh, so I will uh, talk to you all later hope to be doing more videos um, really really soon I'll just you know maybe I'll just turn the camera on and say hey so anyway talk to you guys later hope you're having a wonderful day thanks for stopping by and thanks again to my new subscribers talk to you later bye